Hello everybody. Uh, well, I got some uh, more Snyder Cut news. So today it's been revealed, uh, Zack Snyder revealed, I think on social media, that uh, the move, the, the Snyder Cut, instead of it being a miniseries, will, will be a one shot. So that means that will be, instead of, it will be, you know, break broken up into four episodes, I think it was going to be. It's going to be one movie, so it should be four hours. So that's, to me, great news. I mean, I can I can watch a four hour movie. I mean, like uh, for example, Godfather was really long, so I can I can sit down and watch a four hour movie. I think hopefully this will be worth it. So I'm really looking forward to this. Um, this is not a cut. I've been looking forward to this for a while. I really did not like the idea of them doing a mini series. I would rather see a whole full length movie instead of I guess watch an episode every week or hour episode every week. I think that would have been ridiculous. So I'm kind of glad. That it's been reviewed. I think this is not rumored either. I think it's actually actually been confirmed that Snyder, Zach Snyder said this is, will definitely be a one shot. Uh, so that's great news right there, also. So I'm really, really looking forward. To it. I can, like I said before, if I can't finish it in one day, then I can continue. Um, you know, you know, your um, streaming, you can just continue where you re where you left off. So that's that's good right there. Uh, so I will definitely, definitely looking forward to this. And I'm glad they they actually doing one shot instead. <laughs> so I'm just just really great news. Also rumored news uh, from it's this person I um well he he does this it's, I guess it's a um, website uh, the digital bits uh, he's I haven't really I don't really I haven't read a lot of his stuff but he's been kind of on point especially when when Avengers Endgame was first announced release so he's been kind of um his his sources has been kind of you know accurate so um. Uh, it was accurate with the Avengers Endgame release date, so there was a rumor also they might release when they, after they finish, you know, people watching and everything, and they start to like, like a blue any kind of 4K, like we go to movies to see in the theaters. You wait like maybe a couple months, and they release it on physical media. But um, I heard that they might release this on 4K Blu-ray, uh, maybe after release or something like that. Maybe a few weeks after the release, I think. I heard like in maybe March or April, along with the uh, Wonder Woman release date. Also, they haven't given, they haven't confirmed that, or they haven't given an actual, you know, actual date. Uh, it's just right now rumored right now that it could release. Uh, I guess it's either this, that within that month, or maybe the release um, after, when, you know, do, when together with Wonder Woman, maybe. So that's great. Two good releases there. Um, hopefully, this movie will be really good. Um, and then we get the release on top of that, the Wonder Woman, uh, 1984 for the people that liked it. I, I enjoyed it. I mean, I did a review on that. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed the movie. I know a lot of people didn't like it, but, um, so that's also room. But other than that, it has, I've heard anything else. I had made a video already about, um, the actor Harry Lennox confirmed that it will be a Martian Manhunter. He will be in there as Martian Manhunter. He did his couple of shots you know he went to film some of his uh scenes also so we get to see we'll be able to see, to see that also i haven't heard anything about green lantern i'm not sure if green lantern's going to be in the movie or not but i haven't heard anything anything about that so um so we'll just, just patiently waiting her rumor that it might come out in march it has not been confirmed yet it's just rumored so um we'll see just looking forward to it. i know they just released the trail of hbo max of the upcoming movies i know like um Kong versus the um, Godzilla versus Kong, which will be in March, so that's great right there. Since uh, the, the pick between theaters and uh, watching on streaming, which I would definitely be watching on streaming because I don't know what theaters open. Because <laughs> first of all, my theaters closed, and even even if it was open, I would not go right now with this COVID going. It's getting worse and worse out there, so it's better just sitting safely in my house and watch it. Yeah. So, yeah, guys, so tell me in the comments below, are you, are you guys excited? Would you have rather seen miniseries? Which I never I never cared for that idea. Uh, but this is for the four hour thing is good news to me. I want I would rather have seen a full length movie instead of this four hour, this this uh, miniseries crap. And I also I also read that also that Zack Snyder actually wanted to put it in the theater again. But right now, it's not a good idea because with COVID and some theaters, are, a lot of theaters are closed right now. I don't think nobody, even so, I mean, would it, would it, would it um, make a lot since people want to go see Justice League, the, the Josh Whedon version. People want to go back to the theaters to see this. It's a four-hour movie, too, so it had to be intermission also. So, and we got COVID going and rampant out there. So, I think it's better just to keep it on streaming and release it on physical media when they, you know, whenever it's all tones down a little bit. So, yeah, guys, so let me know in the comments below if you guys like that, this idea. I know this is great news also. I'm, I'm glad for this, for this, 
full-length movie instead of miniseries. So let me know in the comments below if you guys think this is good news. If you guys don't think it's, if you don't like it, um, let me know in the comments below why. Why would you would you rather have a mini series? I don't know why, but let me know in the comments below, guys. So just patiently waiting for the release now. <laughs> All right, guys. Hope you liked this video. Hit that thumbs up. Hit that notification bell. Whenever I post new videos, you should be able to see it. Hit the subscribe button also. Uh, really, really would appreciate it. Share with friends and family also. Hope you guys are staying safe. Please stay safe in this crazy world right now. Stay healthy, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.